Grand Seiko has a Seasons Collection, which celebrates 24 seasonal phases. And if you are like many people and didn't realize that more than four seasons exist, well, Grand Seiko is here to help educate you. Each season has six phases, which all have their own distinct character. The season that we are discussing today is called Toji, embodied in the SBGE 269, which is the time when the days are short and the air is crisp and clear, and the snow muffles the sound of the wind. The dial of this piece has a texture and color of the snow that covers the landscape and shimmers in the crystal clear light. The GMT hand catches the last rays of the evening sun. This is the time when the winter solstice has arrived. What's up everyone, it's Chris with the Little Treasury Channel. Welcome back. This is where we bring you awesome watch content at least once a week. And if you haven't already, please make sure to smash that subscribe button and hit the notification bell to be alerted as soon as we upload. I'm from Little Treasury Jewelers, which is located in Gambrels, Maryland. And it's where you go when you're in the know. As always, the watches that I review are for sale and can be purchased, so please see the description below to contact us. In our last video, we reviewed the brother of this piece, which is the SBGE 271, which represents autumn in the Grand Seiko Seasons Collection. This one is called the Conroe and is really breathtaking. Wrist check time. So I always seem to wear my Grand Seiko snowflake on Grand Seiko videos. And I decided today to wear something different. So this is my Moulet Glacute Pomare Go, which has been my total go-to watch all summer, whether I'm running to Home Depot or going to the beach, I'm really comfortable wearing it. So tell me which watch you're wearing while you're watching the video and make sure to tell me why. Now let's get on to the features. The SBGE 269 has a 39.3 millimeter case width, a 14.4 millimeter thickness, a 48.1 millimeter lug to lug, an 18.7 millimeter lug width, and weighs in at 151.96 grams. The bezel is Zeratsu finished, and the case is Zeratsu finished on the sides, but has a stripe of matte finish on the side of the bezel. The lugs are faceted and have matte finish on the tops, with a swoop of Zeratsu and more Zeratsu on the sides. A non-screw down crown can be found at the three position and has the GS logo at the top. The crystal is sapphire and is domed and in box style. The dial is a pure white color and has the blizzard texture. This is a dial that we rarely have seen and only exists on a few other pieces that are long gone. It obviously represents snow. The GS logo can be found in silver and the Grand Seiko can be found in black at the top middle portion. The indices are beautifully polished to perfection and are rectangular with two rectangles at the 12 position to differentiate the 12 from the rest. An odd numbered 24 hour grade can be found around the perimeter in black with a black minute grade above it. The hour and minute hands are Dauphine style and as usual, no loom will be needed here to see this unless it's very dark. The second hand is a simple silver pointer. The GMT hand is in rose tone and has an open arrow at the tip, which represents the final sun of the day. The date window can be found at the three position and has a polished frame around it and has a white background with black indices. A power reserve indicator can be found at the left middle portion and has black for the lowest power bar and silver for the rest with a silver hand. Spring drive can be found in white at the lower middle area and GMT in rose. The case back is open and shows off the beautiful spring drive 9R66 caliber. And you will find a tasteful ghost lion emblem in the center, just like the snowflake. The SBGE 269 has a spring drive 9R66 movement, which is accurate to gaining or losing 15 seconds per month, which is basically within a half second per day. It has a 72 hour power reserve and the calendar link time difference adjustment function. So if you are traveling and want to maintain atomic clock time, this is another good one. It also lets you go back to the previous day. Like all spring drives, the second hand glides elegantly over the dial with no ticks due to the electromagnetic braking system that controls it. The bracelet is a standard five link design and has matte large links with Zeratsu polished smaller links. 
A folding clasp with the GS logo can be found at the end with no micro adjust. The SVGE 269 is actually 100 meter water resistant, and it's ready to remind you that winter is coming for a wonderful $6,000. Now for my humble opinion. I honestly thought that this one would be my least favorite of the entire New Seasons collection, but after taking this home and trying it on a bit, I realized that this one is really awesome. This would be a good alternative to the Snowflake, I'd say, and I would consider it if I didn't already have the Snowflake. The case is really comfortable and sits great on my 6.5 inch wrist. The matte finish on it makes it a little more casual than the other High Beat Seasons pieces, and this dial is just gorgeous in different lighting. Having the blizzard dial is really unusual, and it's noticeable from a distance similar to how the white birch dial works. This piece could be a fantastic travel companion since it is 100 meter water resistant and has the GMT functionality, plus the spring drive which will always make you right on time. I will recommend this piece to anyone who is looking for a first Grand Seiko watch, and this one looks to be a strong competitor to the Snowflake, just swapping titanium for the GMT complication. I also recommend this piece to someone who is a traveler and wants that perfect companion piece to take with you and always enjoy looking at during your awesome adventures. Thanks for watching today, everyone. I really hope that you enjoyed the video. And if you did, please make sure to smash that subscribe button, give this video a like, and go ahead and share it with all of your friends. I look forward to seeing you next video.